The signs were clearly saying no, but by a 3-1 vote, the executive council today said yes to the controversial Mount Sunapee expansion project. Exploitation of this natural resource for private profit is unacceptable. The issue has been debated for years, but it was only last month that the Department of Resources and Economic Development approved a plan that would create four new skiing trails, a new lift, and a new lodge. Supporters of the plan say it will mean more money and more jobs. It's about a 20 percent increase, maybe 25 percent in skiable acreage, which we hope translates into approximately a 20, 25 percent increase in revenues to Mount Sunapee. The ski area leases the land from the state, which stands to benefit, too, by increased tax revenue. But those opposed say the environmental damage will be great and the lure of more cash is just a myth. The economic development hasn't landed and it's been 18 years. So this, I think, might be an example of, of a practice in, in madness, uh, expecting a different result by doing the same thing. I understand their concerns about preserving Mount Sunapee. I think uh, this agreement hit that balance right and really worked to make sure that we were uh, mitigating any impacts. From here, the plan still needs to go through a series of local approvals and no work is expected to begin for a couple of years. In Concord, Andy Hirschberger, WMUR News 9.